what does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Ooh, can we switch up all the rules? And imagine a utopia a Darling, I'm just so fed up With these expectations They keep weighing me down My heart is begging me What's going on guys? Welcome to my first catch and cook. I haven't really got a plan exactly for this video yet, but um, I guess whatever happens throughout the day, I'm just gonna be chucking all that in and hopefully we'll see some amazing stuff. Um, just earlier, we actually were out spear fishing just out there. We got a couple of coral trout and we swam with some manta rays, which was pretty cool. Um, and this morning, driving out to this island, we actually saw two whales as well. I was lucky enough to get the, the drone in the air and um, got some pretty sick shots. I'm just going to play all that stuff for you right now, and I'll see you in a second. My heart of gold, after my silver soul, can you dig any deeper now?
So as you guys just saw from that um, little edit I just did, we shot a few really, really beautiful coral trout just out front there. Um, I shot my first and probably the best footballer trout I'll ever get. It was honestly just massive, it was just sitting at one of the bombies under the boat. Saw it in literally the first two minutes of jumping in the water. Just really happy with that. And then literally five minutes later, we were just driving over and we um, saw a couple manta rays. We jumped in the water, shine with them. And yeah, it was just incredible. Um, so for those of you who don't actually know me, I thought I might uh, give, my, give a little background on myself. So uh, I grew up in Bali my whole life and I just recently this year moved to Townsville and I'm studying at James Cook University. I'm currently doing my Bachelor of Marine Science and um, in my spare time I go and do this. And yeah, it's pretty awesome. That, that's, that's Alex. So um, for this video, I won't actually be doing um, a catch and cook. I have obviously gotten a bunch of coral trout, but I haven't got the supplies right now to cook it up right here. I will be doing that in the next video though, so if you're looking for that sort of stuff, that will definitely be in the next video. Um, and yeah. Alright, what's going on guys? These are the two coral trout that we shot yesterday. I'm just gonna fill them and cut them up right now and I'm just gonna show you what we do. So for these sized ones, I prefer to scale them and just gut them, get the most out of them rather than just filleting them. So I'm just gonna show you guys what I do with that. And so you just grab tail, just grind up fish. For any of you that do scale the coral trout, you will know that scales come off very easily it's not a difficult job so just do this until you're done all right so now after you've already scaled both of them what you're gonna do is just put the knife straight here and just dig it all the way down to this fin right there and then what you want to do is just get those out of the way and just slice straight through the gut down this way like so and now what you've got is all the guts and stuff just in there if you just pull all that stuff out like that all right so now that i've removed all the guts out of there it's filleted that's pretty much ready to go all we'll do is put a bunch of spices on it put some butter inside and some lemon and then put it on the barbecue. And so, if you wanna see again, just stick the knife in there, drag it up all the way through to the fin right there. And then you just wanna go behind the fins and drag it all the way through. Just meet it about halfway through its length and then you've got it open again right there. All of its guts pretty much will just fall straight out pull it up and yeah that's pretty much that's all you pretty much have to do and now it's ready to go on the barbecue